the hardest question is of course uh, what happens to cows sheep and viruses is scientifically and perhaps philosophically interesting what happens to human beings is 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 in some way uh, scientifically not more interesting but personally for the people because we somehow belong to this species it becomes far more important and interesting in what happens or what can happen with with biological engineering to which which contains a number of a number of, of problems interconnected problems some of them are not key not entirely within the, the the definition of biological engineering but they are see advanced biological te- techniques some of them are in operation even now and some indeed create a a, a a fair a fair amount of of uh, uh, practical problems even now uh, which are problems of contemporary problems that are even now as uh, facing facing people are those that are connected with artificial insemination one field which is a practical a social psychological and religious theological impact there is another that is less common but in so many ways uh, not surely not less uh, important or, or, or may become more, uh, more important is from uh, from foster mothers to which is perhaps more of a legal legal uh, social problem to implanting fetuses in in a in a foreign womb into transplanting a fetus from one place to, a, to one womb to another up to the point which is it is just uh, it is just a development because some of these things are already done some of them are stopped by by uh, uh, legality in one in one country or another and if if they, they, they are possible they are physically possible they will happen in in some in some future which is going going uh, human human beings completely in a uh, uh, out out of any any uh, biological environment but in a in an artificial womb up to the again a, a parallel a parallel development which is again not very far from, from that and that's about cloning uh, cloning of uh, of animals which is done already and the cloning of human beings which is as far as we know had not yet been done but All these problems are uh, basically uh, our uh, practical problems I mean if it is done how it is done and if what can be done because there are even with biological engineering we found out that that sometimes uh, developments that may seem to be uh, completely rational and 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 perhaps inevitable I have some difficulties in which they don't develop in the desired 
פייס אור את אור. ג'ין רפלייסמנט או ג'ין מניפוליישן is theoretically possible. Things like this have been done in many, in many cases. They are still not done in, in any real successful way with, uh, on, on humans or even on higher animals with any, any real rate of success. They seem to be, to be problems still for, but these, these are practical problems that may, they are not, they are not the theoretical, theoretical questions, and the, the theoretical questions are possibly a myriad of, of questions. Now, let me just add to these questions something which is not developed for the time being now, but it is, it's again, what we call it science fiction ideas that are sometimes frighteningly closer to us than we perhaps would like to. And that is a, a different way of, uh, of, of, of a, not of bioengineering, but of, of, of dealing with with, uh, with creating pseudo-human beings, what is called robots, which are perhaps not, uh, not as feasible as, as others, but they are, they are a possibility. Robots, androids, of different, different kinds. Now, there are, Except for the, for the, I'd say, the practical difficulties, there are then conceptual difficulties about how, how are they, uh, how they conceived. Uh, as uh, some, somebody would say, will the results be considered human beings, or won't they? Will these, uh, these uh, artifacts or, or new things be considered as, as just as vehicles, as machines, as uh, mechanical, mechanical bodies. Now, in some way, uh, in some way, uh, perhaps, unfortunately, some of these, some of these problems are so very modern that nobody in the past uh, gave any amount of time to think about them, to define them properly. 